Good morning everyone. Hope you're having a wonderful Sunday. I'm in the mood from for um, preparing some food on Himalayan salt plates. They have become very, very essential in the kitchen. They've come to the U.S. maybe the last five years. People have learned about it. They, uh, this little guy here has come out of a huge, huge boulder and they come out of mines in the Himalayans. Mainly Pakistan. Pakistan is one of the, uh, the most exporter of Himalayan salt and they have been for thousands of years using it. It's a wonderful way to cook, to present, to grill, and it's beautiful for presentation. Look at this gorgeous color with all the little different tints in it. You can put it in the fridge if you're gonna present something cold on it, say cheeses for appetizers at a party, or uh, sushi, tar tartar, tuna tartar, anything like that that needs to be cooled. You can also put it in the freezer. And I've used it many times to grill salmon and filet mignon, which is wonderful because it imparts some of the saltiness into the food. You don't need to salt it. I've done it on, on the grill, on the stovetop, but never in the oven. You should never use it in the oven. And you should always increase the heat very gradually. For the first 30 minutes, put it on low heat and then start gradually increasing the heat because it dissolves, it's a natural um, item, it dissolves very fast. Uh, so it can go up to 300 and 400 degrees to cook on, but you have to start gradually. And the way to clean it is under warm water, never immersed in water because it can dissolve fast with a soft scrub, sponge, brush. Then let it dry naturally. And it has to be 72 hours before you can use it again. Keep it out naturally drying. And it's just a wonderful, uh, healthy way of cooking because obviously it's full of minerals and it's been used for hundreds of millions of years as a salt boulder. It's a great vessel for serving and presenting food. And today I'm gonna be using it for a nice presentation of a charcuterie board. Today's presentation of fruit and cheese is on a Himalayan pink salt plate. 